uh, too many. Uh, Gross elements. Yeah, and L dies plays against B Dog. You could kind of give him credit for it. Yeah, B Dog plays Fox. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, the, the reason I mean, why. It's definitely there. Like, he understands the basic fundamentals of what you do against Fox. And everybody who, who plays Rosa will tell you if you got Fox off stage, he's dead. Or you're not worth your salt as a Luma. Yeah. Rosalina Luma made. Well, and I mean, it's I just feel a sad truth. But I feel like L dies like uh, off stage pressure and presence. It's been improving, but it's not completely there yet. Uh, we played friendlies earlier, and he was actually doing oh, a. Guys. Adam, this is two out of three. Uh, I feel like he was doing a pretty good job at like um, doing some off stage things to me, and mm -hmm. I mean, what's it called? I, it was Luigi, so it's like <laughs> <laughs> yeah. you can't if you can't get Luigi when he's going low. And your Rosalina and Luma, it's a rough story. Because yeah. like, you could just do down air to footstool. Because if I air dodge, then that's that's game over. Game over, man. <laughs> it's all over now. It's all ogre now. <laughs> Shrek is love. Oh, God. Shrek is life. Dan has a headache. Might as well just Advil. The Yoshi prescribed version. <laughs> Yo, Yoshi eggs? Perfect. I just don't understand how Yoshi is not physically dead. Do you know how many times he's banged his head against the... Okay, same thing with Mario. Same thing with Luigi. What is wrong with this family? Why did? Why are they bashing their heads against every hard surface that they can find? There's army strong, and then there's head strong. Oh, my God. <laughs> Speaking of which, this is brought to you by Vigia Games <laughs> and being streamed by Colorado Smash. And shout-outs again to the venue. Collinwood Art Center. Always super nice to come in. They always got different art um, pieces up. Always changing. Super nice. Super chill. All right. Here we go. Well, speaking of chill, it's probably a chilly night here on Battlefield. Starting off the match right, uh, looks like El Dyes is going for more of the aggressive approach and Nomad is sticking to more of his traditional uh, defensive approach. I'm surprised El Dyes didn't ban this, knowing that He's playing Fox. Well, fact, this is Eldai's favorite save. I think he thought that he had a, a easy win, knowing that I think Nomad was just going to go here. Because I know one thing, B-Dog does not kill off the top. Or kill. <laughs> but, uh, I mean, Eldai's could probably condition himself and adapt to what's going on here. Let's just hope for the best for both players. Right now, Nomad actually running away with the lead. Nice back air, getting him 86 to 32%. Luma finally coming back into the fight. Maybe Eldise will have more of a chance. Ooh. Never mind. <laughs> wait, wait, never mind again. There's wait, hope. wait. Wait. Okay, we're good. <laughs> I, was, I was about to say, if he Ooh. doesn't get away with this. And you play Rosalina and Luma. Have you ever faced like Nomad's box with Rosalina? Um, not really. Um, right here, dead, nothing. Back air can catch I would've that. just waited, yeah. I would've just waited and or did back air. just fall down up air, but. Yeah, but I, I would've did back air yeah. just because I, I would've known that would've killed. Like, like anything. And I think again, that's just uh, kind of understanding more of the character's recovery. Uh, I mean, again, he plays against the Fox, but these two Foxes are completely different. We have three foxes, and I feel like all of them have their different Ooh. pluses and uh, downfalls. And that was a good Dead. forward smash in this part. Should have. All right, Nomad probably going to go for some offstage shenanigans, I can assume. Oh, no. Oh. It's up smash. He just needs to get a little more percent to have a comfortable lead. There it is. Oh, and almost gets the kill right there, but I really felt like he should have did upbeat. That would have been nice. Ooh. There it uh, is. Oh. <laughs> throwback to... SoCal's new PR video, yeah. Larry has a clean kill off the top with an LP follow on Nairo. Exactly. And I mean, I've done it before too. It's Ooh. actually not too hard to set up. But, but it's what's... a high commitment move that. But it's so swagalicious. And he. Okay, no, he wouldn't have died. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, now he can go for it. Ooh. And he's going to get down there. Good, uh, good suggestions on El Dai's oh. part, but he cannot get that back air out fast so. enough. L dies. Favorite stage, Battlefield. Does he go back? I I would hope no. Um, he probably might go to Dreamland. He looks I, like he's thinking about town, it. Town, Dreamland. 
Anything with a low ceiling to catch him with the up airs. Which is bad because they both benefit from the same thing. Yeah. But it's who, who can get there first. And I feel like Rosalina but, should if you play defense properly. But it, mm -hmm. it's hard to play defense against someone who's running away. And with the fast faller of Fox, it's really hard for him to get out of her everything. Pretty much. Yup. All right, well, they're fist so, bumping. They're going into it. Oh, Omega. No, the, oh my gosh, those nerves. Those nerves to the max. There's so many nerves. Three, two, one, we don't need platforms. Go. Uh, <laughs> I'd like to collect money now for calling Dreamland. <sighs> oh, Call collect. Hey, I'm the one that said Dreamland or town. Yeah. Come on now. I'm a fortune teller. <laughs> Give me money and I'll tell you what's going to happen to you. Yeah. And I know Nomad's probably hoping and wishing for this stage, so mm -hmm. for him to go here is like, yeah. I mean, he took me here. It was super close. He took you here twice. Oh, did he? Oh, yeah, yeah he did. All right, and so we got L dies kind of going for Oh, no. Oh, if he would have died, I would have cried for him. That would, We definitely would have had Sid Flowers. To that the Luma early kill. And it's not going to be too bad here. It's still low percents, and it looks like L dies has a good idea of where to stand to get these defensive options, but I feel like the real important part is the follow up after he hits him. And I feel like he's not landing those. Like, uh, for instance, we knocked him off stage and he opted for down air at like the complete wrong time. There's zero follow up. If anything, it just needs to probably practice movement a bit more and just get a feel for what happens when he hits people a certain way. I hit you here, therefore I need to go with this move. Ooh, Instead nice. of just going off reaction, as his tag says. Yeah. And going more off of a, I know this to be true. Well, I don't know. Right now, his. Uh, oh. Yeah, it's me. I'm, I'm dying on the inside. That was a down air for free. And even then, it looked like he was opting for forward air, which I don't quite understand. But that's okay. It's his match. He will try to find a way to, uh, a way to win, and he's actually not too far behind. And it's Fox, so yeah. he's, he could die to anything. Rosalina can accidentally sneeze, not even in his direction, and Fox will probably catch. Oh yeah! <laughs> yeah, some type of recoil, and he'll die. Hard attack, that. <laughs> yeah, influenza like Pocahontas. Do they make medicine for foxes? They do not. Ooh, good follow. All right, and. <laughs> After he said he doesn't know how to follow up, he goes for the follow. That one was good. That was. I said he hasn't been following. Ooh. Oh, drag him down. He's dead. Yeah, he could have <sighs> went for the offstage game, but he's actually going to stay on stage for this one. Luma taking hits, which I think is actually costing Nomad a bit with just getting a longer lag time from actually hitting something and giving Eldaz a chance to punish him for you. Versus yeah. me trying to punish him for enough smash and it doesn't always work out. Well, what's weird and kind of funny is that I feel like the things he was doing to you, he should be doing to L guys and then vice versa. Like he should be Laser doing a lot more up smashes to Yoshi. And then in this situation, I think up tilts are better. Just because if Luma gets in the way, at least you still get Rosalina in the air and Luma can't interrupt you. If anything, I think him versus me with all his like moves, he was just worried about getting punished. I think it was nerves. That is A-OK, -okay, but we are back in the... Oh, my gosh. We are Fox back in the back air. <laughs> Fox taking off his artificial leg and pulverizing Rosalina Luma with it. We are not going to call anybody because we do not snitch. You've Here seen we... Guardians of the Galaxy, right? I have not. Really? Mm. And we're back. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he oh, went man. for it. Finally, I think he's starting to catch on, but he, now he needs to get the timing right. And Nomad could have went for the up air there, but that Luma actually causes a lot Ooh. of problems. But Nomad right now building up damage relatively quick, making it hard for L guys to do anything. Good forward air, getting him up to 68. Can he continue to get this lead? <laughs> With that Luma out of the way, he needs to go in a bit more here. Now's your time. It's your time. There it is. Belongs to you, Fox. And uh, I mean that second game of chicken right there. Nomad Ooh. going for the smarter read and. Uh, L dies barely saving himself there. I felt like that might have been a questionable situation going. Oh no. Oh what? He should have hit that. I thought it'd be questionable. Going for that. Oh, down air. Alright, and so Nomad going back to the stage. There nice it is. Top smash. 2 0. And now we have to play. Again, I just fight who I commentate with. That's how this goes. <laughs> I always fight 
one game after I come. <laughs>